Hello everybody, in this video we are going to see how the protoboard works. We'll use the protoboard to design circuits in the Technology Workshop. So let's see how it works. Let's explain it in Tinkercad. We'll create a new circuit. And now we are going to select a protoboard. Plaga de pruebas pequeña, for example. Yes, that one is enough. So if we select it, let's see how the components are connected. Okay, we may connect the positive here. You see that all of these points are connected. So if we connect the positive, for example, here, it is going to be the tension it is going to be in any of these holes. Okay, so all of these are connected. We may connect the negative terminal, the GND, for example, of a battery here. All of these points are connected. So if we connect the negative terminal here, we are going to have this tension in all of these points. Okay, same here. Positives, and negatives. So how are the dots of the center of the protoboard connected? All of these are connected between them. You can see the numbers here from 1 to 30. So this one are connected, that one's connected, connected. So if we want to join this part with this part, we may use a wire between, for example, this point and this point. Okay, so, the, so this is how the protoboard works. The positive and negative terminals, all of them are connected in horizontal. And the dots of the center, they are all connected in vertical, while there are two parts. This part and that part. So if we want to join, for example, dots in number in row number one we may connect the terminal the dot for example d with the dot for example f with a wire okay so we'll see how we can use the protoboard in other videos here and in the workshop see you soon